new mattress has to go in there to do that I need to pull everything off of this one okay I move the camera now to a stable position I'm going to chuck my hoodie down there then I'm going to chuck some pillows down the corner space conservation if I kind of get past stuff <laughs> can I get the mattress past stuff Try and guess what height I am. <laughs> this is about six foot seven where it stands because it's got a couple extra inches of packaging. Before I continued, I did go and measure that. It was about six seven or six eight. That should make me roughly six foot. And the mattress is now expanding. Oh Jesus Christ. Do like a fucking condom. It was this giant deck you've ever seen. Other than myself, of course. Oh fuck. If my TV doesn't work after that, I'll know why. I smacked my smart TV with a big fucking mattress. I'm about to turn a whole bottle of water on camera. So here, where that Adidas logo is, is the point where I used to be able to knee up to the bed. There's my knee. With a new mattress, <laughs> it goes up to my hip. To be more accurate, it's probably about three and a half feet off the ground because I'm not an absolute giant you know <clears throat> here's my math I've got three mattresses all at 20 centimeters that's 60 the base is slightly more than that at 40 that's about a hundred centimeters off the ground I don't know how that works out in height or rather in feet so I'm waiting to figure that out three foot three point three seven that's quite tall I just thought four feet, but then that would mean my whole torso is two feet. I don't think so. I believe you would save about 80 quid if you didn't have as big a bed as me. Bugger. It takes so long to sit up on this bed, I couldn't even grab a toilet roll to blow my nose quick enough before I sneezed. Oh, that's so much better. So I was phoning Tarkan at 1 o'clock today. Oh, up until 1, I should say. I was phoning between 2 and 1, and he goes, oh, I'm so tired. I was like, okay. He was like, oh, I'm not going to go to sleep. I'm just going to sit here. I was like, here we go. So he went, oh, tell you what, I'm just going to go for an hour nap or something. I don't have two hours in me, Baba. So I thought, right, okay. He went to bed, or to sleep rather, for a nap. And I've just woken him up 20 minutes ago. 20 to 4. He was like, oh, Jesus Christ, 20 to 4. I was like, yeah, you said you didn't have it, did you? But I decided to wake you up now rather than later. He was like, oh, fuck, so why couldn't you phone me earlier? I was like, yeah, well, clearly he needed it. And that he must have done. But I've been enjoying my last two nights on this mattress now. That's shocking, I haven't filmed in two days. Oh, well. They've been very good sleeps. For a £235 mattress, it's fucking what it weighs as well. Not really, 20 kilos, but there we go. For that expensive a mattress... It was worth it. I didn't want to go the extra couple hundred and pay for like a Simba mattress. Because I don't know if they're quite worth it. But this one was. This one was worth what I paid for it. It says on the sheet... 17 millimetres of memory foam. And therefore it was also about... Was it... 170 millimetres of foam? I can't remember actually. It must have been somewhere around 28... It's a 30 centimetre mattress, I believe. But it's somewhere around that. If I googled it, I could probably find out, but I can't be bothered. Either way, I know it's a very comfortable mattress, that's all we need to worry about. Also, good news! For my birthday this year, I am buying a private licence plate. So you see this one behind me, that just says my name on it. That style of licence plate has become a legal, I've told you this before, in September this year. So obviously I won't get one that's 3D. That's, what, that's a bit of it that's illegal. Also, you can't just get a license plate that has your name on it, unless it's for art, like mine is. <clears throat> so I've been looking online, and I found, well, 
let's say a few good ones and I believe I found one that I'm happy with but I'm not going to tell you my, <coughs> my private license plate before it gets put on a car because then you might buy it before me or I don't know I want to leave the whole thing a massive surprise until I get my car now originally those strewn plates were to cover my license plates when I take photos of my car however if I'm going to have a private license plate it's going to almost say my name on it then you might as well see it anyway. It'll be my plate for the rest of my life, so you know. Anyhow, uh, hopefully soon. But the plate I'm going for is about £250 all in. That's the DVLA's transfer fee and the cost of the plate, which I believe is about £167. I hope I'm right with that. Perhaps. Oh well. It's only two weeks until I can buy it. Because that's where I get paid by Universal Credit. And then I'll obviously use my birthday money as my Universal Credit. Like, what I would use that for. Anyway. Before I move house, I was going to get a desk and a new monitor. But now I'm not sure. I want a car, most importantly. But I'm thinking, if I get a brand new desk, that means having to break it apart. Well, not break it, but take it apart. Fold it all up. Put it in my car. Should I have one at a time. Transport it to the new house. Monitor, having to pack it very carefully. <laughs> You know all that? So instead, what I thought was, why do that now? Instead, wait until we find a new house. Wait until we get the keys. Then when I've got my own set of keys. Um, I say that, you know, like when we move in, when I get my set of keys, when they have theirs, whatever. Uh, I will start ordering stuff to that place. So instead of getting them here, just get them directly in my boxes to the new place. So you get a brand new desk, brand new monitor, all delivered to the place where I'll be living for years. You know what I mean? Instead of risking breaking brand new stuff. When I move house, I also plan to get a new Xbox as well. Because the Xbox One S is fairly old now. I mean, they've got the Xbox One X. Uh, they've got the Xbox Series X and S. <coughs> they've got so many. The thing that worries me is the fact the Xbox One S is more powerful than the normal Xbox One as well. So I was sitting there thinking, fuck, what must the Xbox One run like now? <laughs> anyway, I won't bore you any longer. I better go wake Tarkan up, eh? Because he will sleep tonight and he'll just bore it me. <laughs> anyway, see you soon. Thanks for watching, like, subscribe, turn on the notification bell if you haven't already. And I will see you all in the next video.